What I can absolutely promise you is that brave measures will be taken. I will be emphasizing the importance of community, of devolving as much power and responsibility down to the communities where things really happen on the ground. We'll probably all agree about the big issues. The candidates will agree. It's about the approach to dealing with them. It's about me using my experience, about my entrepreneurial experience of how you make something out of nothing, how you give much more responsibility to the neighborhood networks, to the neighborhood partnerships, um, to the neighborhood forums. And um, I think that that's a matter of grabbing as much power as we can from government and redistributing it. It's not about me as mayor holding on to power. It's about knowing how to distribute that power. I'll be giving a message about how we put Bristol first in all what we do. The reason I stand as an independent is that I feel so strongly that we need to change the culture of governance so that we can use all the talent in this city. I mentioned that there are good people, and mainly good people, on the City Council who want to make it a better place. I believe only an independent can bring the best of the talent across all parties and none, and infuse people from outside the council to get involved in the governance of this city. I know there are some of you in here who have voted against the mayor, and I think that gives a special responsibility to whoever is mayor to make sure that that is about enabling people rather than wielding that power too aggressively. Being a mayor is about managing a team. It is about inspiring the whole city. And it is about making sure that every city in this country, in Europe, and that across the world, is not just talking about Manchester but is only talking about Bristol and the extraordinary transformation that's happening in this city. And I need all you to help me make that happen. Thank you.